Hey there, fellow Etsy entrepreneurs. Welcome back to my channel. If you're looking to supercharge your Etsy shop and take it to the next level, you've come to the right place. So today we're diving into the five key elements you need to be successful on Etsy. So whether you're a seasoned seller or just starting out, these tips will help you thrive in the world of handmade and vintage goods or in my world of digital products. So let's get started. All right, everyone, there are five essential tips for Etsy success, and this will help boost your shop's performance. So starting off with number one is volume. All right, in the competitive Etsy marketplace, having a wide variety of products can work wonders for your shop's visibility and sales. But wait, don't go adding a bunch of random stuff just yet. You wanna focus on creating a cohesive product line that aligns with your brand. Think about what sets you apart and offers products that resonates with your target audience. So the more items that you have that fit into this mold, the more opportunities you will have to attract our customers. So you do need volume to rank, all right? All right, number two, let's talk about optimization. When it comes to Etsy, the key is to get found by potential buyers. And that means optimizing your shop and product listings. Use relevant keywords in your titles, descriptions, and tags. You wanna be specific and detailed but also remember to write in a way that appeals to human shoppers, not just search algorithms. You want high quality photos, accurate pricing, and compelling product descriptions. Those are all essential for making your listings shine, right? You want people to find your store, you want them to find your products. All right, moving on to the third tip, trends. Staying up to date with the latest trends in your niche can be a game changer. Shoppers often flock to Etsy looking for unique on-trend items. So research what's hot in your category, find ways to incorporate those trends into your products. But remember, it's essential to put your own creative twist on things to make you stand out from the crowd. So for example, I'm a teacher. My niche is teaching and teaching products or products for teachers, things like that. Staying on trend for me means I need to be trendy, but in the moment. So if say spring just ended, right? I'm not gonna make products right now for spring because people aren't looking for that. Could I? I could, I could try to get ahead for next year. But right now, teachers are looking for Halloween, fall, Thanksgiving. So those are the things that I need to load now. I need to publish them now. Yes, I'm talking to myself. I need to get on it and get it done. All right, number four, consistency. So let's look at consistency. And it's not just about consistency, creating new products, although that is important. They say when starting out, you wanna do about one a day. That's if you want like a super strong start. But it's also about maintaining a consistent brand image and customer experience. Your shop's branding, packaging, and communication should all reflect your unique style and your values. So when customers come to your shop, they know what to expect from it. They're more likely to be repeat buyers and recommend you to others. All right, and last but not least, tip number five, research. Successful Etsy sellers are always learning and adapting. Keeping an eye on your shop's performance metrics like views, favorites, and conversion rates. Analyze what's working for you. And it tells you what isn't working, right? So stay updated on Etsy policies and best practices and always be on the lookout for marketing strategies and tools. If you wanna research other stores in your niche, you don't want to copy anything because that's not unique to you, right? But it helps you figure out what the trends are. So research your niche, research your customers, see what they're looking for, research, research, research. <laughs> All right, so there you have it, my fellow Etsy entrepreneurs, the five essential ingredients for Etsy success. We have volume, optimization, trends, consistency, and research. Can I get all five? <laughs> Remember, Etsy is a dynamic platform and success is not gonna happen overnight, all right? But these five things, once you put them into place, consistently applying these principles and staying committed to improving your shop, you'll be well on your way to achieving your Etsy goals. All right, so if you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel, Teacher Casey, for more tips and insights on running a successful Etsy shop. 
or teacher-ish things. And don't forget to share your thoughts or questions in the comment section below. I love hearing from all of you. And that's it. Until next time, happy selling on Etsy, everybody. Stay creative, have fun, and I'll see you all then. Bye.